It'll no longer be like America's jaunty hats. Wait, what? It'll be divided into 17 states, and you can drive on an American highway from Florida to Alaska. Oh, no. And eventually, over a bridge to the Kremlin town. The people need to know. I gotta talk about it on my show. But how will I prove it to be? And no one be allowed to speak French anymore. Lousy French talking bastards. And they'll pay taxes. Oh, sweet taxes and more. And once I've got Canada, then if you don't like it, you can go. Cause I ain't gonna annex freaking Mexico. So go on south of the border, you. I need a witness. Let me hear you say yeah. Are you hearing this? I need a witness. I need to know if you're listening. Well, put down your whiskey. Grab a glass of truth. You gotta hear what he's saying, cause on TV I'm gonna bring it to you. Cars that run on whale oil. That's what I'm saying. Yeah! No! Yeah! What a way to start the show! Could it be that Carrie's having a change of heart? Nah. <laughs>
take this warrior's <laughs> Will you say yes and make me a happy man? <laughs> I swear that I will be true to just you. No more cover down this to I'll take you, I'll take this warrior's hand and I'll make you gonna Get to sing in this song. I was afraid, I was afraid to make the leap into the deep, dark, darkness that is commitment. Well, come on in, cause the water.
backwards. And now, having done your purpose, you're fired. I'm dropping you. No use for you anymore. I have no use for the son of a statesman who lost. Why, no one knows Laquanda Kerry or Frederick <laughs> Humphrey or John Stevenson, son of Adelaide. <laughs> no one remembers them. <laughs> Give me another chance. I'll no, 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 you're done. Go back to your indie circuit or your playing your garages or whatever. You know what? Involuntary Ragnarok was going to rock the world. Right. Uh, well, uh, uh, you did that, and your dad lost, and now I'm done with you. So well done. You've ruined the country. Live with that. But thank you for the money. Well done. <laughs> this is the way out? Yes. I Get out! Oh, I don't right. care which way you go. Don't. <laughs> to make money. So that's what it's all about for you, just the money? It's about cereal. I can't even buy Cheerios. I need Cheerios, <laughs> toddlers. <laughs> That's right. The devil walks among you. Surprise. <laughs> you like my makeup? I thought you might. Let's hear it for our band tonight. Jonathan Green, Paul Durso, Lolly Allen, they rock so hard. Let's take a look at the People's Candidate, Scott Turner. 
your hero, man of the people, and loser. <laughs> the last we saw him, all sorts of secrets were revealed. His head's in a spinning daze of spinning dazedness. And that's why he needs to have a chat with his daughter, Bowie, and get some family perspective. <laughs> I've set the scene. What does it mean? I smelled it again, the brimstone. It's like there's a satanic presence surrounding me this whole election. Dad, just calm down, okay? We can get through this. Calm down? Calm down after I've seen Jesus Christ and Thomas Jefferson almost fight it out over me? I'm a mess, Bowie. I'm having psychotic visions of former presidents and messiahs. <laughs> No wonder I wasn't elected. That and my incredible stick to itiveness for compassion. What a stupid quality that is for a president. <laughs> compassion is what got me here. You are an amazing father. Got me here. Yeah. Got me here, which is oh. nowhere. First loser. Great. It's time to rebuild, okay, Dad? We can rebuild this family. With what? My tarnished reputation? Oh. The fact that I have a, a concubine seems to have turned the public against me completely. And even you, my son, what you renounced expect? me. What do you expect? You cheated on mom. I mean, she's cheated on you, but still. Yeah. <laughs> and then my mom has cheated on me, and she's not married to me. The whole family is so sexually voracious, we'd never be president. Well, Dad, I've never had sex on him. It's time for a virgin to lead us Cause nobody else seems to be able to Maybe it's time for us to realize Virgins are the ones No experience, that's the quality that a president needs. We need someone like you, Bowie. Cause you could succeed. That's why it's called the White House. White House. An immaculate home where virgins should dwell. And <laughs> well they do. If it's you. ready to elect a virgin queen, though. But she is pretty hot. Do you smell it again? <laughs> anyway, let's move ahead. Take another look at something else. That's right, Scott's 
vice presidential nominee, Hart. He was in on the whole thing. He's glad that Scott lost. And he was sleeping with Scott's mom, Kitty. So let's see them, now that the shit has gone down. What a chop a doodle -hoo. Well, I'm so sorry that we have to share these bad tidings, Kitty, I mean. Oh, I bet you are. What do you mean? It just caused this whole thing to, to go to shit. I've never heard you speak that way outside of a bedroom, Kitty. Because I'm out of the You should have thought of that before you slept with me and raised your son. No, don't come so close. You always make me so horny. <laughs> I'm sorry you feel that way. Oh, oh wait. No. About your glasses, they'll be there when we're done. <laughs> oh, baby, you know that ladies they always want the baddest one. Although make sure they're on vibrate and hold them up as if you have a bunch of lighters. But don't actually use lighters because that would be a fire hazard. That's right, right there, see that? You rock. All right, let's move this riffraff off the stage. Yeah. <laughs> I like it when she grabs my ball. This here is Scott's brother, and this is his wife, and they've been having an affair for 10 years. Let's see what happens now.
Growing skunks. The way I've always wanted. Oh, God, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. You'd be the best skunk wife I ever imagined. I'm quite sure you're going to have a response to this. Do the math, do the math, do the math burner. 20 years and what did we produce? Take a look at my family. Bowie is my daughter. And Beverly's yours. Beverly, my pride and joy. Beverly, a brilliant boy. Dark, exotic, and handsome and talented. Beverly is yours, yours and mine. Yours and mine, do the math, do the math, do the math.
need fancy special effects to make this show awesome, but it does make it more awesome. <laughs>
knowing that this is not his son. <laughs> oh, this is so much fun.
Whose son is he? Whose son is he? Tell me, tell me. Send you back again, make you go, 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 go far away. Send you back to the hell that you came from. You and your spawn of my what? son. You ain't my son no more. You may say I love the horse, but you love my brother. You love my brother. And it's over. It's over. No. 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 show get out of here you too too there is a villain in this piece and it's Jefferson Hamilton and him and Hart the other villain are having a good old time because they won so to speak when they're confronted by Molly and Eagleson that's all I know let's let it go
recorded the telephone. <laughs> Two Diet Cokes and a pizza. <laughs> yes, I got it. But it looks like you're gonna have to do something more if you wanted to feed us. Well, you're gonna have to get your hands dirty. You recorded a takeout order. What the hell is going on? It's some bad transmitter made in Nippon. Well, how are we gonna take them down now? We got no proof. I guess they're gonna rule this land. Oh, what a goof. Oh, why did you make a plan? You know we had a plan. Why didn't you make a plan if you were gonna make a stay? Your liberty, cause I will not be defeated by one man, no matter who he be. So you better think twice if you're gonna try to take us down. Cause you cannot. You better have like a gun or something if you wanna take us down. It don't matter what you got. There's nothing you can use to prove anything right now. Of our great nation are, 
but perhaps even more devastating, telling us, well, me. And now I present to all of you, America, that he has rigged in the election. That's right. Jefferson, oh, Wilson, <laughs> Hart, the third Davis, uh, all those names, the third, <coughs> rigged the election.
Jesus has begun. Shout out! Shout out, Jesus! Shout out, Jesus! Shout out, Jesus! Let's find out what happened to all these people, one by one. That's how every show should end, with Jesus wrestling with a gun. And a song called Heart Holiday. <laughs> Tina stayed with her husband, and they worked things out. And sometimes they kept Liza around. Heart got shot and he died slowly and painfully. That's pretty much it. Burner Turner went on to become president after his brother. Unfortunately, his presidency kind of sucked. Molly and Eagleson got married. Once he'd been released from prison for killing a man. Even though the man was bad, you still can't shoot a guy for no good reason. And... Uh, Scott lost his legs. And I'm not sure why, he just did. would have married Carrie, but Carrie died. So instead, she married someone else, Ethan Hardwick. <laughs> Next, Frigga and Beverly got married and they had a baby and apparently another baby that wasn't born yet. And involuntary Ragnarok topped the charts, my friends. But only in Europe. Kitty Turner founded a school for people who like to have sex a lot. Jefferson Hamilton was actually not killed, but he was driven insane and taken to an insane asylum where he lived out the rest of his days eating flags. All right, that's been our show. Let's finish this up. Thank you.